Hey there guys, hope your day is going well. My name is Rotor and welcome to Choo Choo Charles. Now, to address the elephant in the room, I did just get out of bed. There is a stack of jackets that's always behind me and I just kind of rotate, um, which lately has just been pulling whatever is on top and I wore this to go to the movies last night, so it was just on top. My hair's messed up. I'm not gonna do anything about it. We're gonna play some Choo Choo Charles because this game came out a few days ago and uh, YouTube is now full of it, and I don't want any of it spoiled. Because I woke up and immediately saw Markiplier was streaming this, and all I could say was, Damn you, Mark. So we're going to play some Choo Choo Charles. Thanks, Mark. I was really hoping to put this off until Wednesday. I'm in so much pain. Choo Choo! Damn it. I know it's been a while since we last spoke. But something has happened at the mines I've been supervising. No, trust me, you'll want to make time for this. If you're looking for something big to keep your museum in business, well, there's something big on that island. Real big. So many friends. And even my own son are still out there. If anyone can bring this thing down, it's you. It'll be the biggest attraction your city's ever seen. And you can help an old friend. Yes, meet me on the docks at sunset. I hope you're ready for a little monster hunt. You know, everyone's probably most aware of this game because of a game called No Snakes in This Hotel or No Snake Hotel, yes, which I just never got around to playing. Call him Charles. Half train, half giga spider from hell. We've been planning his demise for some time now. And Giga Spider? In order. Just a few people to meet and places to see. Simple errands, you know. <laughs> yes, sir. Welcome to Aaron Nero. Can I? Oh, the island oh I can. Where miners dig their own graves. Stay close. Charles isn't the only thing to fear around here. Oh, what? Uh, I guess minecarts would go through here. How you doing? Interactable items There's will glow. A train shed at the, top of the, hill. the fact that your mouth doesn't move. One of the train operators was killed early on by the beast. So his old engine should be in there. If we can get to it. It could be an indispensable tool on our journey. Stay close. We don't want to be exposed for too long. Should I be playing this with a controller? Hey, oh, oh, don't run away. Come back. There's a train. Keep up with Eugene by sprinting. There's a train and a heart in the lower right. Hello? Hello? <laughs> it's probably dangerous to walk off on my own. But it sounds like there's something out there. Anyway, hello! Oh, shucks, it's locked. Darn it! Not to worry, we can still find a way in. Can we? There's Forget. a small shack Sorry. up the path that might have a key inside. Take this map. I just marked the location on it. See if the key is up there, and I'll look around some more down here. Up here? Uh, M. Ah! Okay. My god. That was a loud one. I don't like the sound of that rustling. Ah, key. View items with I or Y. A small gold key that can be used to open the brand, 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 blah, blah, blah. Well, glad we came up here.
Oh, what's the the top of the? Good on you. Looks like you found it. Open up that door and lead the way. Ba, ba, ba. Can I close the door? Nope. Explosives. All right, hold on. I need to have a look around, Eugene. I don't seem to be much here. More explosives. Okay. We planning on blowing Charles? Sticking with it. Nope. Mm, just nope. Nope. Gonna stick with it. Okay. Let's go. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. She's an oldie but a goodie. I'm going to inspect the train's exterior. Why don't you take a peek inside? See what we got to work with. You got it, Yudge. What was that? Oh. Uh-oh. That doesn't bode very well. All right. Use it to quickly navigate the island. Your epic train. A weapon shield against your foes. A respawn point if things go wrong. Interact with items around the cab to learn. Okay. Oh. Okay. So I have to collect scrap. Upgrade and repair your train using scraps. Find scraps by looting or completing missions. Click upgrades to purchase. Skip tip. Okay. Uh, we got stop forward and reverse use the gun to aim guns will get briefly jammed from overuse all guns have infinite ammo new guns can be earned it's not easy to aim is it All right. Cool. Hi. Right. How you doing? Hey, Paint. Well, the exterior is a little rough, but everything looks to be intact. Well, that's fantastic. That gun you were looking at wasn't on here when I was evacuated from the island, but it sure looks fun to use. <laughs> evacuated. We can light up Charles with it and take him down before he even sees us coming. I don't think so. Are you ready to take this thing for a spin? Hell yeah! Okay, center lever to move, left to disable during tutorial, right lever will stop the train. Leaving the train while it's moving automatically stops it. Cool. Choo choo! Oh! Ah, baby. We're no! For you, Charles. Paint! Do you hear that? It's him! It's him! Oh, Jesus. You're horrendously beautiful, Charles. Eugene, no. Well, Eugene's dead. Sorry. See you around, Eugene. Wait. I can go back. E. <laughs> this isn't how things were supposed to end. I thought we could still fight like the old days. Yes, sir. Easy in. <coughs> Easy out. You'll need to do more than I thought, but <laughs> I don't have time to explain. Find the eggs. Find my son. You dead now? Okay. It's fantastic. All right. Our train took a little bit of a knocking. That's all right. I love this art style. It's slightly cartoonish.
It's like slightly cartoonish, but real. Okay, I think I found some scrap. All right. Okay, so... Unmet NPC... Required mission... Weapon mission. Okay. What does that sound? Okay, that's an animal. Sign indicates a split. The light at the split indicates the direction. So let's go in this way. Oh, wow. This is a lot bigger than I would have thought. Yeah, okay. Ah. Hey. Oh, wrong button. That's why. Haha. -ha. Okay. We're going this way first. Stop your train and interact with the lever. I'm surprised I don't have a horn button. Alright. Can I have that? That's not scrap. Okay. How you doing? It must be the archivist that Eugene told us about. We're happy that he came to help us out of this predicament with Charles. Man, man, Hold on. First of all, terrible voice. It, it makes me a little unsettled. Regardless, I run a museum or work for a museum in some way. Why am I here to kill a train? Am I going to bring it back with me? You know, that old train of yours will need some major upgrades if you want to take down Charles. Why didn't you tell that to Eugene? There are some metal scraps in my barn that you could use to improve it. Here's the key to the barn. Oh, thanks. It's just up a path, but I'll mark it on your map anyway. Thanks. Can I go in here? Nope. Mining Company. Charles. Charles Mining Company? Okay. So Charles is also the name of the island or the company here? Oh, what's this? Chicken feed, goat feed, fencing supplies. We'll scratch all that. No need to feed or fence animals if they've already been eaten. I know there's a bloodthirsty train just riding around any corner for me. <coughs> even though promised... Even, <coughs> even though Eugene has promised to send help once he reaches the mainland, I've realized he never mentioned if he'd return. I suppose he is his own type of person. To ignore the fine details of a plan, everyone on the island trying to find a way out of this mess, and I can only hope that the archivist friend of his can work some magic. I don't care what strange things they've done before, or what practices they use, as long as Charles ends up dead. Most folks around here want the same, but then there are those crazies that want to leave him be. That darn Warren has lost his marbles. Who's Warren? Orn's not his son, is it? Now you have some resources. Go back to your train and make some upgrades. Interact with the blueprints in the cab to upgrade menu. Okay, let's just get back to my train. I don't trust anything that I hear behind me. Okay. Uh, we'll increase damage taken. And repair it a little more. Repair it all the way. Cool. Can I talk to you now? No. 
No, we'll go this way first. All right. See you around, mister. Oh. <gasps> yay! <laughs> it sounds terrible, but yay. I wish I could place a marker. Hello. I need my pickles. I ate the last jar of pickles I had in my house, and there's only one jar of pickles left on the island. My secret jar of pickles, locked away inside my pickle cave. I would have gotten them hours ago, but I lost my pickle cave. Someone pickle else key. Has the The, the the fact that their mouths don't move is super unsettling. Is that supposed to be blood or carpet? Oh, I don't like this. Pickles are love. Pickles are life. I love the pickles. They make me feel happiness. Pickles, pickles, pickles. Cool. Crazy lady. Gotcha. I think this is blood. Ah, I need a key. Pickles, pickles, pickly pickle pickles. Hmm. Okay, sure. For now, I could say. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go here. I'll meet this guy. Then we'll branch off, go this way, and go back around, and go down here. That's the plan. My goodness, the others actually convinced someone to come help us. What a voice. So glad you came, <coughs> but I simply cannot stay any longer. This island is too much for my nerves to handle. I've brought all my belongings here so I can leave immediately when a boat arrives. Although now that I think about it, I did forget my journal at home. Could you bring it's a dangerous journey for sure? But you might manage with that train of yours. I'll give you all the scrap metal I have. Just please bring the journal next time you're here. Okay. Well, I'm not heading there yet. I'm going this way first. We're going to go here, and then we're going to head down here. All right, good talk. How'd I get in here? Is that this island? I've been praying someone from the first evacuation group would just send back another boat, but I guess they all think that George's supply boat is still evacuating people. They're all safe and cozy on the mainland, but feel no obligation to make sure everyone else escapes. I know that Charles sinking the boat isn't something anyone would expect, but still, to think, I would have left this place by now. It makes me sick. So Charles sunk a boat. <laughs> Charles seems like a quite the little devil. Alright. To the train! And the track is already facing the way we want to go. That doesn't strike me as a good thing. Forward and reverse speed. All right, here we go. Oh no. All 
I get the feeling... Did I just see something? No. Surely not. I get the feeling Charles has been here. Oh, more blood flow. It's gotta be carpet, right? No, it's definitely not carpet. Before the cave-in, I pushed a spare rail car into the canyon using my beautiful old mining train. I figured a rail car would be a fine place to hide my more important belongings, especially on a rural and unfinished track. I went back to get something from my rail car in the canyon about a week ago, but some of Warren's men have built a campsite or base. Some sort there. I don't know how to go get my box safely. I don't know how long it'll last without it. Sir, th this, the, oh, this is not, this can't be very sanitary. You seem to be sitting in blood stains in a Welcome blood floor. to Araniram, archivist museum person. It, Thanks. My apologies. I'm not the best with introductions, but I don't believe either of us are here for socializing. True. I just so happen to have a little business opportunity, if you're interested. Does it have anything to do with getting a box? A very special little box of mine is in a rail car in the nearby canyon, but the goons have set up a camp to so who's Warren? the area. So be careful. Find the blue box. I'll give you some... Okay. Who's Warren, exactly? Oh. Okay. Well, that's just up the path from here, which we were going that way, so we'd be up that way. I can see. I'll go see what's the worst that could happen from the sounds of it these are crazy cultists they might have weapons and they might want to kill me that sounds fantastic is that a guard post I'm about to die what's that? ah no! Nip, 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 nip. We gotta come back. Hey! Yeah, they're cultists. I don't like the sound of any of this. Get in the train. Get to the train. Just get to the well, damn train. Nope. No. <laughs> nope. Mm -mm. Nope. Mm -mm. No. Hey. Hey. Go, 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 go. <sighs> There's something there. I assume I'll be there later. Oh, it's Charles. So Charles is roaming. Good to know. You know, just fantastic, actually. Real happy to know Charles is just doing his own thing. Got 15 scraps. Let's go for speed. Okay, now we're going to pass back through the station we left. Boop, boop. We're going to be purple for a bit. No, let's go back to being yellow. Actually, you know what? Makes me a little unsettled looking at a yellow stack. Oh, Charles is just up the hill there. That's that's great. Um, yeah, shite. Yeah, 
No. No. Recharge! Come on. Charles, I really need you to piss off right now. Ow. Train health isn't doing so great. There we go. I did see something back here I wanted to look at. This caught my eye. We sailed past. All right, nothing else here. Oh wait, 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 wait. Okay, just in case. All right, now we go. Hello. Eugene told us we'd have a newcomer soon. I suppose that would be you. How'd you know? There's some scrap metal in the balcony room of my house that you could use to repair and upgrade your train. Here's the key. And oh. as a side note, talk to anyone around here, and uh, they'll do whatever they can to help. Anyone not wearing a mask. Check out the balcony, and take whatever you luck with everything. Thank you. Can I have a gun? Like, preferably one not mounted to my train. The game expect me to come this way first. What do we have here? We've been waiting as patiently as we can, but the past few days have been chaotic, to say the least. Charles has been more aggressive lately, to the point where I'm starting to fear how many of us will be left by the time help arrives. Godspeed, Eugene. We're counting on you. And then there's a path here, which then leads down here. All right, hold on. Before I just randomly walk off, but he's not bound to the train tricks. Hi. Well, hello, darling. Hi. I'm making a fresh stew with ingredients for my very own swamp. But I smell a carcass on the island in the swamp, and if you wait over there and bring it back for me, although you'll need to be wary of Barry. Just keep an eye out for him splashing around, and don't move if he gets close to you. As long as you... Sure. Lovely. So close. Come on. I need you to give me some space, Barry. Hooray! I made it back. What a delicacy you found. Here are those scraps I offered. Have a oh, well, thank you. Thank you. Um, okay. So that's her. Okay, I need to go this way. And find a path back to my train. Alright. So our next stop is here. 
There's also a house down here I see. That's probably gonna come into play. Oh no, an abandoned train. You know, maybe Charles is just mad. Mad that all of his ancestors have once and long been abandoned on this here island. Maybe the real monsters are yo all along. Oh. The door did open. Hi. Look, kid. I know you're supposed to be some fancy pants monster hunter, but you can't earn my respect without making yourself useful. What's that? One of Warren's goons dumped a locked chest in the yard last night. After beating on it for a few hours, I didn't break anything but a sweat. Why's your face so flat? I got some lock picks, but I don't know how to use them. Here, take them. Have you... Sure. Oh, this is how I get to the pickle chest. Return to Daryl to complete your mission. Critical item acquired. It looked like a spider. <laughs> well, fancy fingers here got the chest unlocked. <laughs> That's an odd looking piece of junk you found inside there. Bit of a letdown to be frank. You earned my respect, so here's some scraps, like I promise. It feels reasonable to assume that I'll get collectibles as I do things that'll just kind of sit in my train. I don't know, that looked like a drawing of a spider from what brief of it I saw. Got 39 scraps, so let's just, uh... The monster hunter has arrived, I see. Oh, well, thank you. This is no ordinary hunt, mind you. We've already tried fighting Charles, but he retreats into the wilderness if he is sufficiently harmed. I've we noticed. believe there may be a way to get Charles to commit to a mortal battle, however. Dispersed around the island are three eggs, locked in the island's three primary mines. Our theory is that putting these eggs in the temple at the center of the island will provoke Charles into a fight to the death. Unfortunately, the mining company owner, Warren Charles III, has placed armed guards inside each mine to protect the eggs. There's an egg in the mine just down the rail. Here's the key to the mine. I've marked the entrance on your map. Okay, so it's not this. This is a weapon mission, so we're gonna go see what that is now. Please tell me I'm safe here. Well, you don't seem to be aggressive, so... I made a little flamethrower as an addition to my spider train home defense plan, but as you can see, it has slightly uh, backfired. <laughs> Nearly cooked myself alive in that shed as I was testing it. Shoot dang. I would love to save the shed, though. If a uh, flamethrower somehow still works after the fire dies down, well, you can take it. I'd assume you're the monster hunter that folks have been expecting, so a uh, weapon like this could come in handy. So I'm a monster hunter museum runner. Okay. Find a way to extinguish the fire. Do I need to use my train, or just... Okay. I wasn't sure if like, I needed to shoot with my train or something, but nope. Yep, super easy. Barely an inconvenience. Using the water tank to put out the fire. Pure genius. Woohoo! Here, take old bug spray. Cause of this chaos. I don't want to see it anywhere near here again. Shoot dang. Shoot dang. You should train to customize.
So wait, is this just like a flamethrower for the train? Yes. Ha. Huh. Increase all weapon damage. And we're orange. That's a good looking train. Oh, we paint over the Charles thing now. Right? Yeah. Cool. All right. South mine. Oh, well, here we go. Mining has been proceeding smoothly, and we're seeing signs of solid vein already. The tools are still holding up, while... Well, and we finished. We finished constructing our shelter. We haven't spent long here, but we're getting settled in and adopting a good rhythm and schedule for our work. Well, that's great. So is this where things go bad for me? There's no one here. While mining the farthest tunnel, we broke through a wall into a large cavern. There's something strange here. Don't know what it is. We're requesting that Mr. Warren visit the Southern Mine at his earliest convenience to give us further instruction. Eugene, Team Supervisor. Stealth. Can't crouch, though. I hate that there's a stealth element. Ooh, ooh. Green paint, cool. This is all very normal. Yup, super normal. Before I mess with that, I'll just have a look around the other side, just in case. Hey! hey. Ouch! There's only one guard in here. Fantastic! Shoot! He's right on my tail. I could really use a gun. No, you're not. That's not a sound I want to hear. You leave my train alone! I can't help it that you're jealous! Come on, cool down. Charles? Okay, he's retreating.
Unloading all the supplies has been an incredibly eye-opening experience. Here at the port, we've been working all day, every day. We're tasked with unloading the boat and running supplies up the hill to the tracks where Theodore and Eddie deliver them to different sites. We'll be mining. The sheer cost of this infrastructure is mind-blowing. With all the success Warren's family's had in the business, I'm surprised he's choosing to take such a risk here. All right, back to the train. Continue on up and get another weapon. And hopefully some more scrap, because, uh... I wasted a little bit of it there. Mm-hmm. This doesn't feel like a place I'm supposed to be right now. Can I interact with this? No. Great. Love the best. So wait, has Charles, the, the owner of the mining company, infused himself with the spider train hell spawn? Is that what I'm together? Well, that looks interesting. I'm stuck debating if Warren made us bring our families to this hellhole so that we'd never need to leave or keep the information about his business practices away from the mainland. Either way, I want the man in a noose. Paul asked me to design a new weapon for the monster hunter, and Eugene is sending. And knowing what I do about explosives, you can bet I made the most powerful rocket launcher I could. Warren, you don't stand a chance. Paul asked me to design a new weapon to help you hunt Charles. And using my extensive demolitions experience, I made this rocket launcher. I've been wanting to see Warren's empire crumble for a long time. So building this puppy was a hell of an opportunity. Now that you're here, I need a few minutes to remove some safety features. While I'm working on that, why don't you bring that box of rocket ammunition back here from inside the bunker down the rail? Oh. Okay. Sure, it's worth a rocket launcher. But first... I need to write this theory down before Warren finds out I'm on to his dirty plot. My theory is that Mr. Warren, Warlord Number 3, is trying to hatch and raise more of these eight-legged critters, my whole army for who knows, for who knows what purpose. They found a whole nest of those eggs while clearing the debris from the cave-in. We also know that there's hard as diamonds, completely indestructible. The miners spent months using the temple prism to suck the energy out of all the eggs. But before they could destroy the last three, old man Warren stopped them. Warren must have realized how powerful these things are, and rather than protect us from them, wants to use them to take over the world. I'm on to you, Warren. Greg, genius extraordinaire. I I'm sure Eugene told you all about me, so I need not introduce myself. Uh, Nate Greg, by the way. I already grabbed one. We're unsure why he wants to protect the eggs. If they hatch, they would surely turn into monstrous creatures like Charles. To prevent this, we, we need you to steal all three and, and use them to bait Charles so we can destroy him. 
Uh, one, one of the eggs is, is in the north mine. Uh, here's, here's the key to the entry. Thanks. That's all the way along over there. Cool. Now, there is... Unmet NPC up there. So that's where we'll head. First, and then we're going to go get the rocket ammo. And come back for my rocket launcher. Hopefully. Ah, it's a lighthouse. And it is powered off. Presumably to keep boats safe from this island. Far away, never to come near by. Near. By. Near. By. I'm sorry, I don't know what's wrong with me. Did I just get what I need for this? I think I might have. All right, let's talk to you first and I'll read your note. Oh. We haven't met, but I've heard lots about you coming to help us. I have a favor to ask. The breakers on the side of the lighthouse yep. was recently attacked by Charles. So okay. breakers are in the nearby supply shed. Got them. Once you finish, I have some spare screw. Cool. So we're bringing the lighthouse back online. Please deliver a copy to Paul. I went outside to do a routine check of the lighthouse. As I walked around the corner of the building, I saw a beast, Charles. He spotted me and charged straight up the hill in my direction. The spider train is a hideous monster. I can understand why Warren wants us to stay on this... Arenarum? Instead of trying to escape the beast, I suppose Warren has simply gone crazy thinking he can handle this situation on his own. In any case, Charles can Charles ran right over to me, trampling my leg. I won't be able to attend the upcoming meeting, and I have asked Greg to bring back a copy of my notes if possible. Clear. Why did it make a horn? We increase our chances of being spotted. Here are those scraps, I promise. Doesn't it also increase our chances of Charles coming back? Thanks for the scrap. How sentient is Charles? Is he like fully cognitive, planning and strategizing, or is he like a wild beast? I don't even know what I just picked up. Ah, that's what I need. Cool. Great. Ah. Ow. I thought I was far enough away to not get hurt. Oh, there's blood. There's ah, ow, the blood. I just feel like I'm doing a lot of stuff right now that might bring Charles to me. Turned on a lighthouse. That's both visual and audio because it made a wah sound. Uh, then there was the big bomb that we just exploded. The launcher is incomplete. Oh, and take good care of it. After you're done, I have a few people to visit with it if you catch my Okay, so it's a very slow fire. But high damage. Hey, you're that monster hunter. Say, I so I am. Know. 
Do you have any experience with ghosts? Someone or something has been pinning exactly 16 drawings to lampposts in the boulder field every night. I always collect and burn them, but as I was looking for them last night, I began hearing strange noises and seeing strange things. I only found half of them yesterday because of the commotion. Could you go find the last date and bring them to me? Eight. Eight. Mm, I'll have to think about that one. I'm really gonna have to think about that one. I don't feel like playing some Slender Man nonsense if you catch my sayings. I mean, I guess it's not that far. Sure, you know what? Why not? Why not? I've already been recording for an hour and a half anyway, so why not? It is Slender Man. Fantastic. Cool. We're genuinely just playing Slender Man for a side quest. So if I die, I'm not coming back to this anytime soon. Three to go. We've got this. I am a little curious as to what it is. I want to see it this time. What are you? It's... I really hope that was it and not Charles, because if that's Charles, I am toast. Oh no, that's Charles. Oh boy.
this thing is getting faster, which makes searching harder. Damn it. Come on. Ah, uh -huh. <laughs> Cool. Thanks for bringing me those papers. Here are some scraps for your help. Bum bum ba. All right, continue up the path just a little bit. Probably to that light. <coughs> oh, damn it! Oh, you son of a Charles! Get out of here, you Thomas and friends reject. Damn it, I'm gonna have to run up there. But I should have time because Charles is going to go heal his wounds. Okay. Well, let's finish these people off. It sounds wrong. Yep, that's the way I want to go. I'm going to go down, back through there. Can go this way. <clears throat> I have nothing more to lose. I've made up my mind to swim to the mainland, or at least try. Likely won't make it, but I still see my chances being higher than out here on this forsaken rock. Who's that? Oh, hey, look, it's our boat. Not a whole lot to really talk about at the moment. <clears throat> Just recovering some pickles. Here you go. Yup, thanks. Can we leave her behind on the island? Can we just leave her here? I mean, I guess we're here to save the island. Uh, so. Might not be necessary. Okay, yeah, we'll stop at the next turn for Santiago. Oh. So squelchy. Thank you so much for bringing my journal. I would hope, for your own good, that you didn't peek inside. But, um, here are those. Was it an option for me to peek inside? Don't think so. Might have been. Oh well. Okay, we just follow the tracks. If it's just one guy, I think I can do it. Don't know. I'm gonna try. 
that's not what I want to hear. Shouldn't be here. Stop right there. Hey, you stop shooting at me. You better run. Yep, don't worry about it. Peace out. You think I could shoot him with the rocket? I want to know if I can shoot him with the rocket. He's got to still be chasing me, right? No? Okay. That's the exact box I needed. I needed. Well, you're welcome. Now take these scraps and skedaddle. Mm. No qualms there, my guy. Fully upgraded train. Charles stands no chance. Except for the fact that he does. Oh, it's got horns now. And spikes. Cool. Didn't even notice. Choo choo! Alright. Doesn't matter which way we go here, but yeah, this way is technically faster. When we get to that one, we need to make it take us up. Okay. Now we'll head up and talk to these people. North Mine Blue. Probably better to just get this as I pass. Ow. Ow. Beat it. My question still stands. Well, that answers that. It is possible to deal with them. Did have to bring him a lot closer than I would have liked. But oh well. Probably because I don't get a normal gun. That they only seem to be one at a time type of enemies. Simple enough. I'm going to guess this is the blue egg. Nobody gets near the egg. Ow, hey! I was reading that. Derailed. Okay. I'm gonna play it this way. We'll play it this way. Oh. 
Make sure nobody gets near the egg. If you see anyone that shouldn't be there, shoot them immediately. No risk can be taken. As soon as it finishes, kill it and bring it to me. We got the egg, we're getting out. Don't care about the extra scrap. If there's lore, I apologize. But, yeah, I'm not getting continuously shot. Hooray. Just get to the damn train. Okay, yeah, okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. A Rinderum Municipal Building. We're good. Oh, so good. Sorry, Charlie, I'm in a building. I hope he doesn't know how to work buildings. What the fuck was that? Nice telescope, buddy. What is this? Stakeout summary, day three, location four. I've been staking out this area for days and Charles has never crossed the old wood bridge. Somehow, that beast is cunning enough to know it's dangerous. But if he's angry and desperate, he might chase someone across it. Then BAM! We'll use John's bombs to blow the whole thing. Charles falls into the first canyon. If the blast doesn't kill him, the fall surely will. Sure about that? Or the archivist my father told me about. Oh, Although, he's I'm dead. Disappointed to see that he chose to stay on the mainland rather than return with you. That's not nope. to say that your help isn't appreciated, but we could have used his aid as well. He, yeah. You haven't already heard from the others. The mine boss Warren is protecting dangerous monster eggs that could lead to catastrophe. While our main plan is to summon Charles into a duel and fight him to the death, we've devised a perfect trap as a precaution that may help defeat him. Mm -hmm. Go attach these remote explosives to each of the support pillars under the wood bridge out there. Then meet me back here. Oh, it sounds lovely. Why didn't I think of that? Mutiny meeting notes. I have discussed our latest battle plan with everyone and nobody had objections. The whole crew knows what we have to do and the tracks directions accordingly when the time comes. All the archivist needs to focus on is pummeling the beast, keeping his distance and getting Charles to his weakest point. My father should be back within two days, at which point we can supply him with the hunter and the keys and the other supplies we've gathered. Ah, We never wanted to take such harsh action against Warren and the other miners, but has twisted our arm too long. Charles needs to go, and Warren won't stand in our way. Bombs! Yeah! Great idea. Return to Paul.
No oh, shit. Piss off, Charles! You'll never get my money! Damn it! Oh, I thought I... What? That's the tallest and weakest bridge on the island. So if Charles ever crosses it, we can blow him sky high. Can we? I'll be on standby to detonate the charges, but it's still up to you to summon and fight him. Here, take this. It's the once you think you're prepared enough, you can break in and fight the battle of a life. Thanks. It's not much of a break in if you give me the key, but I assume you're referring to the uh acolytes at Charles. The checkalites, if you will. It stopped raining. I just noticed. The hell is that? So, the fabled hunter has finally arrived. You know it! You know, my late Ma. husband built a gun to help fight Charles, but Warren's goons stole the barrels and took him up to their camp. Uh -huh. Bob was such a brave man, much braver than you, I bet. If you take what I have left of the gun and steal back those other parts, you can put it back together to use against Charles. Just do me one favor. If you do end up using it, name it. You got it. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, we'll head there. That means this last guy, person, is going to have the key to the third mine. Get the red egg, I'm presuming. Today's sermon was a true inspiration. During these trying times, very well thought out and thorough in every manner. I believe I speak for the whole congregation when I say we admire your confidence and steadfast wisdom as we grieve our lost brothers and sisters. Who's that directed towards? God is very, very mad, I think, probably. Charles is maybe devil, 96% certain. Always sneaky, spider versus snake, spider have more leg. God always wins, hopefully. Sacrifices? Ask for volunteers. Don't cry a lot, only a little. Closing prayer, clean up. Hey, paint, it's black. You know, that brings out the rust. I'm, we're gonna stick with this. The archivist, in all your radiant glory, Paul entrusted me with a key to one of the mines containing an egg. But before I give it to you, I have to warn you about something. There's an ancient shrine on the island, a pyramid of sorts, with a curious prism located at the top. The prism seems to have been designed for one purpose, to destroy Three slots are carved into the prism, which perfectly fit the eggs. When fully loaded, a massive beam of energy is emitted, seemingly drawn from the eggs themselves. The mutineers hope this event will lure Charles to a mortal fight as he comes in defense of the eggs. Now for the real warning. Charles has the ability to absorb energy from the burst strengthening and enraging him. We saw it once before, and he may become even more dangerous this time. However, it's not my place to oppose, despite the danger. So, once you have retrieved all the eggs and the key to the shrine, we might just be able to end this hell. At last night's meeting, Greg told us a crazy conspiracy about Warren trying to use spider trains for world domination. As part of the crew that worked in the temple, I'm far from convinced. While the prism wasn't extracting the life energy from the batch of eggs, Charles attacked us for the first time. Not only did he fight like hell while the eggs were being destroyed, but he nearly doubled in size as he fought, as if he were consuming the energy. 
His legs grew larger and stronger while his face grew more distorted. Right before our eyes, those of us who survived couldn't even fathom what we witnessed. That was when Warren hid the eggs and ordered us to protect them. That was when he began to evacuate people. That was when everything turned for the worst. I know Warren has plenty of skeletons in his closet, but I can't help thinking he might actually be looking out for us this time. It sounds like it. So Warren might not be a crazy mad genius man, but rather just a mad crazy man. Weren't we already there? No. No. No, we weren't. Okay. So we gotta start here. There's someone here as well. Something there. Okay, let's start here. Okay, that was... God, more of these creepy masks. Simple enough. Simple enough. That's locked. Explosives. It's too bad I can't grab any of those. Oh. Delightful. Hey, guns. Can I have those? Nope. Great. We've been digging for over a month and I'm beginning to wonder what we're really doing here. There's an ancient stone ruin above ground as well as ruins being discovered underground. Some sort of temple in a large cavern uncovered from one of those mines. Are we really digging for gold veins? Like, I could see these cultists thinking that they're on the side of Charles whenever Warren didn't actually intend for that to be the case. Oh. Bob acquired. I think Bob is probably the best well-rounded gun. Though it probably overheats. Anyway. Oh. Okay. Hey. Aren't you the new guy who's come here to work for us? In a way. You must be. There's something at the top of these towers that I need. And don't worry, I won't make you work for free. I'm a nice enough guy to pay. You see, Mr. Warren never told anyone from the mainland about his mining operation here. He never even reported the cave-in. He hasn't paid us since then. Our living quarters are atrocious, and I'm far overqualified for the pay I'm supposed to receive. To top it all off, none of us miners ever received copies of our pepper work. But that doesn't affect my subordinates as much as someone with my status. I'm gonna sue the pants off of Warren once I escape this island, and I need those files to prove that he keeps all his files at the top of these towers. I could explain how I ascertained this, but I doubt The problem is, he erected these towers years before we ever started mining, and now I could scale them myself. As a reward, you can... <laughs> okay. So, I'ma just kill about some tires. That. That what's going on? Oh, yeah, seems like it. Parkour! That's locked. Fantastic. Oh, just so fantastic. 
It's just locked out. It's locked. Oh, look at this. We got some scrap. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, my legs! Okay. I got a note. Setting the foundation for this operation has been considerably more complicated than I ever expected, not only by cost, but by logistics and construction and delivery of supplies the primary mine site. We'll need to strike gold fast if we want any chance of avoiding bankruptcy. That one's locked. Oh, that's got to be carpet, right? Quite the yellow phyllo cabinet. Phyllo phyllo cabinet. Yes, a yellow phyllo cabinet. Ugh. Oh, I felt wondrous. Oh boy, that doesn't sound fantastic. You look like a monkey climbing those. I sure am glad I found these. Here's that scrap you don't spend it all in. Well, hopefully I can make it back to my train. Sure would be a shame if I were to perish along the way. It's one big gun. Okay. Now, I think we go back. Oops, I tab clicked out. Okay, yeah, so I think we go back. And then we go this way. We'll go around. Is this the thing I was seeing? Oh, yeah, it is. So where am I? Mining in the new location has been going smoothly, but we found something of interest. A path we've been... unconventional, but Warren finally revealed our team is looking for more ruins similar to the ones unearthed in the southern mine. After visiting the other ruins with Gale, I'm intrigued we may find more to explore. A lot of scrap in here. Cannon, you stupid train. Damn it. Reloading. Or cooling down, I guess. Come on, Charles, piss off.
Well, now I've got to go around, so. I don't know how I feel about Bob. It's, uh, range is great. Damage is three. Slowing fire rate. I don't know, I guess Bob. Ah, oh, you know? Like... Bob just doesn't quite have the power that I'm looking for. That's a, that's a bit of a slow fire. Our train is fully upgraded. This Thomas and friend reject has no idea who he's up against. And quite frankly, neither do I. One of the eggs, one of the eggs. Scrap, lockpick, and bulky. I don't like these guys. Intruder! Ouch! Please stop shooting me. I'm just here for the egg. Nope. Aha, loser. Well, at least they got lost me. No visitors allowed. Damn it. Hey. Ow. Damn it. Two scrap lost. Oh, well, that's not bad. No visitors allowed. Shite. Where's my train? In rough location to me, where is my train? Get that guy! Great. No one can hear you screaming out here. Get him, boys! So fast. Take him out! This way. This way to the train. It's a long way to run to my train. If only I had known that it was going to dump me in the middle of nowhere, I would have had my train on the standby, ready to go. Okay, we're here. Almost to the train. Almost to the train. There it is. I hope you're fed? Fat? What are you saying? I hope you're something.
Okay, I made it. Now what? <laughs> yep, floating eggs. Get them in there. Oh boy, this can only go well. Charles is close. Put the egg down slowly and lay flat on the ground. You'll hurt far too many people if you follow through with whatever you're playing. My God. Did I do that or did it do that? I don't know no. what just happened. No! You fool! Warren Charles the third. Uh-oh. Hi! Why are you a train? Oh, he's hurry. Oh. So if these guys weren't essentially the cult of Charles the Train, what are they? Black Cannon, Charles! Where'd you go? I will not lie, it is a little loud. Next overheat, I'm repairing the train. Eat fire! That was worthless! He's angry. And it's loud, so I'm getting louder. I apologize. Come on. Come on, come on. Piss off, Charles. You can't have my train. It's more beautiful than you. We're close, come on. Come on! You ain't got much left in you, Charles! Got real lucky with the timing on that if I were able to cross the bridge and Charles, well, do that. Oh, oh, oh. oh okay. That's kind of disgusting. That's a little disgusting. Hey. We did it. Go us. This is our trophy. A bleeding train. Bleeding spider train at that. Woo.
Is that an egg? Oh. Oh no. Is it gonna hatch a baby train? Oh no. That's a lot of eggs. Why are they trained spiders? Why are they trained spiders? Thank you for joining me through Choo Choo Charles, be it one long video or multiple not as long videos. So, all that said, if you guys like this game, check it out. Link in the description below. I'm sure that there's plenty of little secrets around the island that I just didn't get to uh, because I sat down and played this in one go, which is very different for me. I don't usually do that. So, until the next video, if you enjoyed, leave a like. If you want to see it for yourself, link down there. If you uh, want to suggest games, there's a comment section. There's also a description. There's not really anything interesting there other than links that I put in the description. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye.